guys, I can't believe I have to make another video. I said I wasn't going to make another... <laughs> I become one of these YouTubers now. Guys, I said I wasn't gonna make another video, but something epic is just ha it's Something epic happened. Big Ed and Rose finally talk it out. And it is... I got hair in my mouth. Edgar. That's Edgar hair. Ed and Rose. First of all, we're gonna play this clip, uh, latest from TLC, where Big Ed apologizes to his daughter. This is actually a very important clip for context later on in the video. So let's flip and watch it. So what's up? Well, you're right. Yeah, it just kind of blew up in my face. I tried to warn you. So for context here, Big Ed is 54, his daughter is 29, and the girl he was dating, Rose, or wanted to marry even, is 23. I had to do it. I had to follow through, you know? I was upset that you're old enough to be your dad. And I was just like, what are you doing? 23? Oh, she says 29. It. What do you have in common with her? What? Actually, I want to think about that. What, what do they have in common? What does Big Ed and Rose have in common? That has to... I can't think of anything. <laughs> I can't think of a single thing. Maybe the height, they're almost the same height. She's a little taller. Cause you were blowing me off and essentially saying F you, like, I don't give a I'm just gonna do whatever. I was selfish and I'm sorry. One thing that I definitely want you to know is that you were and are and have always been the love of my life. Ah. And we have a, such a great foundation and- I mean, to be fair, Ed must have really liked Rose if he's willing to cut jeopardize his relationship with his daughter just to meet up with this younger girl cross-continent, right? Everyone questioned his motives. But that still just makes him an asshole anyways. <laughs> I'm a dumbass. I'm a human funny dumbass. <laughs> so they make up. Oh, that's so great. That's so great. However, 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 Rose and Big Ed are talking and it happened and it's beautiful. Oh my god, I can't wait for this. It's so good. Explosive! No neck Ed. <laughs> nice one, whoever re-uploaded this. When you were in the Philippines, you guys were able to communicate well. Rose, why do you feel like you need a translator now? Because she mad. I can, I can she mad as hell. Right now. Yeah. <laughs> my feelings... Um... <laughs> yeah, wh what are your feelings, Rose? I can't speak feeling. She mad. She mad as hell. That's the feeling. Angry. Oh. You're angry. You're angry right now. Oh, Look. Ed, Ed is scared. Look at him. Run a facial recognition on that side. 100% terrified. Why are you angry? As he should be. Because my emotion is very... My mixed emotion. I, I can I can speak why, why I... <laughs> what is that face? I feel angry. I feel upset. I feel all, all, all for Ed. You know what I mean? I, I'm not sure, but Ed, yes. how does that make you feel to hear Rose say that? Um, I'm confused. Okay. Look at Ed sipping on that Voss water. He's sipping on that Voss, living the high life. <laughs> nice, Ed. Nice. Immediately when I got back from the Philippines, um, we FaceTimed a little bit, but then um, the last time was, I think Rosemary wasn't it around Valentine's Day. <gasps> what? Uh, Val what? Valentine's Day? They secretly hooked up? Question mark? I doubt it. Valentine's Day. Did you what happened a on Valentine's Day? Call on Valentine's Day? Special. I didn't. Oh. Oh. Rose. No one believes him. <laughs> Who are these? The council? The council have spoken. We do not believe a word, single word that Big Ed is saying. Rosemary reached out to me. Rose, is that true? Yeah, is that true, Rose? No. <laughs> What? <laughs> I I believe Rose, okay, but uh, that's the that did sound like a lie. <laughs> what the hell? No. Rose, is that true? No. I don't know. He's the first to message okay, me. Uh, Rose okay. is saying that it was actually Ed who first messaged her. Oh, it was Ed oh. who reached out first. Oh. Ed, is that true? 
I can show you the messages. I have them all. He here. has the receipts. And what made me mad is she reached out to me and I asked her. It's because I don't want to be rude. I replied to him. Mm. Okay. Okay. Rose is saying that she didn't want to be rude. That's why she was answering messages from Ed. She reached out to me. If she was so angry with me, why did she oh. reach out to me on February 9th? Does that look like she's frustrated or she's angry at me? <laughs> well, <laughs> you see this photo here? Does I have proof that I look angry to you? Oh! You reached out to me. You wanted to start a relationship again and wanted me back and wanted a present for Valentine's Day. There's that face of disgust again. The classic. She needs to copyright it. Present for Valentine's Day. You wanted me to come and see you. And I was ready. Sean, I was ready. I miss Rose. I love Rose. I was ready to give up everything. My daughter, I was ready to give up my daughter. I had already repaired that relationship with Tiffany, but I had feelings for what? Rose. And I was ready to go <laughs> back. What? So he had this, we j the clip we just saw, he's repairing the relationship, but now he's saying that after that, he was prepared to give up his relationship with his daughter again. <laughs> what the hell, Ed? She says. But then I go on your Facebook and I see a picture of you holding uh -huh. a watch. These, this is what is this? What is this? What is this? Look at Ed with all his evidence. Look at this evidence. Irrefutable evidence. What is this? Does this Ed photo look angry to you? Huh? Is you and your girlfriend what? and you had told me that you don't have a girlfriend uh, and i can show you the text it's right here okay what is this rose <laughs> why is it so funny what is this rose so please tell me what this is he came prepared okay, what is going have, on? he had rose them ready in a relationship with he even zoomed in on the text x question mark yes that is a girl whoa the girl since we left Palawan, February 9th, okay. look at it. Okay, first of all, um, Rose? Yes, ma'am. Are you now in a relationship with a woman? Uh, 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 catch this after the next commercial, I'm just kidding. All right, all right. The ten oh Oh, wow, they really did it. <laughs> yeah, are you Rose, huh? Are you dating? <laughs> Why are they so uptight about it? They're broken up, who cares? For now, no. Before, after the break, uh, Ed. Right. <laughs> What's the so big deal? After you broke up with Ed, you started a relationship with a woman. Yes, because I want to move on. So, Ed, did you know that Rose was bisexual? I did. I had no idea. They look like very, you know, pretty sexy Whoa, pictures. Whoa, there's Ed with more receipts. Why is this so funny? I don't get it. Look at these funny photos, huh? Look at these funny photos. Explain this, huh? She reached out to me because she had broken up with her girlfriend and wanted me back and Ooh. wanted a present for Valentine's Day. Yes. I, I want to know what Rose is saying. Can I just have the translator just tell me what is she saying right now? Translator is like, I don't know. I don't understand. <laughs> actually, Ed wanted to get back together and that he was asking for a second chance. Oh, no, God. Why? <laughs> oh. Didn't you say that already? It's just, I'm confused about the timeline here. Now let's bring in Ed's daughter, Tiffany, who has been listening oh! in from her house. She has been listening the whole time. She's been listening the whole time. She heard. Hey, Tiffany, how are you? Hi. Hi, Tiff. Um, so uh, you heard your dad say he was willing to give you up to have this relationship. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh ho, ho, ho. that's the face of a man who know he effed up. God damn it, Ed. I try to give him chances, man. I try, but he doesn't learn. What are you doing? How did that make you feel? That, I will be honest, I was pretty shocked to hear that right now, that when she reached out to him again, that he was willing to jeopardize our yeah. relationship again. And she found out live. This is crazy. <laughs> oh. oh. It sucks. I mean, I'm his only daughter and he's willing to. Yeah, you're not making that face anymore, are you, Ed? Huh? 
You're not making that oops, I guess I messed up face. Jesus Christ, dude. Jeopardize our relationship again for love, which I understand <sighs> at the end of the day, like I want to see my dad happy. I want him, I want to see him with somebody and not alone. But I mean, I can't support it. I mean, there's such a huge age gap there that they don't have very much in common. I would argue nothing in common. I would say that. I, I think they <laughs> But then again, you don't have to have things in common for a relationship to work. I mean, I didn't mean, I didn't mean it like that. I mean, I would... Yeah, how do you, how do you mean it, Ben Ed? Huh? We heard you, dumbass. I'd never give you up in a million years. I would... I mean, I... I, I really... Yeah, yeah, Mr. Backpedal. Going backwards on the back. Mr. Backpedal. Going backwards again. Come on, Ed. Stand up for yourself. For one, stick to what you're saying. Losing you. I was... I put everything on the line. And I, I'm sorry. And I hope you know I love you so much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. You already gave that speech, Ed. Huh? You already remember that? It happened in the last video? We already heard this shit. How many times? How many times, huh? You never learn, Ed. You never learn. You hurt other people that love you, Ed. I cannot stand by. Oh. Tambor I'm, I wasn't gonna hit you, Ed. Tambourine of shame this early. <laughs> Sorry. I was just following my heart. I'm, I'm an idiot. I fell in love. And that's what love does. It makes you do stupid things. And it was a mistake. Now I know it's a mistake. And I learned my lesson. I learned my lesson. No, you didn't. Because you we already been through this. You ain't learned shit, boy. You learned nothing. You trash. Tiffany. So this is your first time talking to Rose, right? Yep. Oh. Oh. Is there a question that you oh. would like to ask Rose? I mean, Rose, why? what did you see in my dad? I mean, did you really love him? Because he really did love you. Because he was willing to give me up. Yes, I really love your dad. I really, don't, really, don't, really, really Don't get it. Don't get it. Don't get a tone with me, please. I'm Ooh. just asking you. <laughs> That's how she talked the whole time, but okay. <laughs> don't get a fucking tone with me! Get a fucking tone with me! Did you have true feelings for him? Yes, of course, yes. I believe her. Because to be honest, from from what I've seen, it I mean, it didn't really seem like it. Oh, oh. Kasi like, ang hirap kasi nang, ngayon nagsisinungali siya na nagsisinungali, paritago sa sarili niya na, alam mo yun, hindi makita ni ba't tao yung ugali niya. Ako ma'am, tiniis ko lahat yun eh. Kahit napakasama ng ugali niya eh. Nasa likod, harap ng camera sa akin, tiniis ko yan eh. Kaso parang kung anong ginawa niya eh. Oh, I hit a nerve. <laughs> Don't get a tone with me. Ooh. Someone just snapped. <laughs> I guess she doesn't know what she said right away. Okay, I can tell Rose is uh, very upset. I'd like for the translator to tell me what Rose is upset about. Okay, um, Rose is saying that she feels that Ed doesn't see or appreciate all the effort that she did for, um, for the relationship. And that- But what effort? But Rose is saying that Ed is lying and trying to hide the fact that he wasn't really a good person to her. But what about all, all the secrets? What about all the secrets? And maybe his height, which I'm not quite under sure how, how you can hide that considering you guys would video chat and Skype, but... Yeah, it's impossible to not see someone's height from a video because I am actually six feet tall. As you all know, 6'11", actually, as you can tell, because I am on camera right now, uh, you can tell my height. There's no way for me to hide my height from you guys, because I'm on the... <clears throat> Simple things that you should be honest about as far as past relationships, especially when you're wanting him to call, have your son call him daddy. Mom, baliktad kami, mom, eh. Sa umpisa pa lang, mom, sinabi ko na sa kanya lahat. Yan, lagi, lagi ko pa, ulit-ulit ko pinapalawanan ka. Hirap na hirap na ako mag-English, ma'am. Na intindi niya sinasabi niya. Eh, may, may ibuti-ibu pala siya sa akin. Napakailan sa past mo. Ikaw, ang akin lang, kung ano tayo meron ngayon. In, inalok pa nga ako ng video call niya na, 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 na inalok pa nga ako ng video call na sex what? video call niya, eh. What? 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 She's saying that she really doesn't uh, care about his past. Oh my God. And that Ed had actually asked her to go on video calls on multiple times. And even asked her to go out on a sex video call with him. Uh, uh. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, really? Yes, this is true. Oh. So, Ed, oh. Ed, what is this oh. sex video that Rose is talking about? 
We're, go we're going here. The council is waiting with full anticipation. What about the sex videos? What about them? See, I think what matters here is when they happen, right? If in a relationship, you send that kind of stuff, I don't think that's that weird. When did it happen? Can you tell me? Can you explain? I am so confused. What? Please. I'm saying it's a lie. It's just a lie. Oh my god. It's a lie. <laughs> even even his daughter doesn't believe him. He's like, she's like, uh, uh. <laughs> I kind of want uh, Rose's dad to come in. Live from the shower. Hey, come on. Come on back, Ed. We'll shower together again. Come on. It seems fair. Ed. His daughter came on, you know? Uh, Rose was saying that uh, during one call, um, Ed was asking, why are you always sad? And Rose was saying, well, we have a lot of problems here. And so Ed said, well, um, get naked now and I will pay you. Get naked in front of me, do it now, and I will send you money. What? <laughs> Oh my god. How do you make this up? How do you come up with these ideas? Don't start making up stuff. That's ridiculous. Come on. Wow. Okay. <laughs> oh, the council seems to agree with Rose. Interesting. I'm so confused. I, I, I don't know what to believe. L let's talk about, um, you know, some of the things that uh, y you were accused of. No, no, no. Don't brush off over that. I want to know more. Come on, Ed has everything on his phone. He has all the logs. I need to know. He has all the happy faces. He has all the sad faces. He has all the angry faces. Come on. So they show all the clips. I, actually, I, I never saw the mouthwash thing. He gave her mouth. I got you a cute toothbrush. A cute toothbrush. This your breath is not um pretty. I love you. I love you. I love you. You're I ugly. Me. You're Does that mean ugly. I love you? <laughs> so first of all, I don't think I was wrong in asking. All right, it's the same answer. I don't care. When you were asking Rose to shave her legs, why did you do that? <laughs> I love the daughter so cringing. Rose, I apologize for asking you to shave your legs, but let me explain. Women in California, they laser their legs, so... I don't know how I feel about this. It's obviously very rude and uh, presumptuous that a woman should just uh, change the way you prefer them. But I feel like in a relationship, if you like certain things about another person, I think you have the right to uh, ask, and I expect them to ask me to do the same kind of thing, right? I wouldn't demand it, and I wouldn't be angry if they didn't want to do it. I don't have this kind of problem with my chat, okay? Because she's perfect. But, I don't think it's that crazy. I think it's all the things stacked up, though. He he asked for the SD test. He asked for uh, shaving your legs, your breast things, and all this stuff. It all came on once at a time, and it just comes off more as, uh, oh, you need to change if you're going to be with me, kind of. That's not cool, obviously. But you understand what I'm making here? The argument? Okay, cool. It was something that I wasn't familiar with, but... I apologize. I apologize. I did give him a hard time. But it did weird me out. I'm going to be totally honest. It was weird, but I apologize if I hurt you for asking you to do that. That was not my intention. I can accept your apologies. Why? Why? Because you always hurt me and you're up, girl. You embarrass me. You're up and come. You embarrass me. I, I accept you. You always embarrass me because I love you, but you're always a liar. Oh, this is getting... A bit heavy here. Uh, I was not trying to make myself look good and make you look bad. I'm through my own natural dumb ability. I made a fool out of myself. <sighs> God damn. It's pretty embarrassing to have your personal hygiene per se out in the public. See, that's the thing. Yeah, I totally get that. Couldn't he have weighed to be out of camera sight? Right. They made a whole thing about it. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand what she's talking about. She is all that needs to feel real. It's genuine. She's queen. I understand she's standing up for Rose, but what the fuck is she saying? This is not an argument. I feel like no woman was ever good enough for Big Ed. He always has to find something wrong with him. You know, put her okay, I, on a pedestal. You were trying to. And also, like, right after they met, he put all these things on her, too. That does definitely not help either. <laughs> like, outside know, the but, relationship. But, but, who the fuck are you? Where do you come from? You're not part of the council. I, I understand that. I know, but 
look, I have trust issues. She wasn't being honest with me. I had the right to ask. And she wasn't being honest issues. with her. That's ironic. <laughs> and why didn't you tell her before you even went there that you didn't want kids? You yes. knew she wanted that. Yes. Like, yes, 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 yes. That was, that was hindsight's wrong. Raising kids in America, as you know, you have two beautiful daughters. They're expensive. They cost money. That no, was I, think, it. I think the problem was you were worried about the money. Now, okay, you know what? Hey, okay. hey, don't point your finger at me. Hey, don't hey. point your finger at me. Hey. I'm protecting <laughs> people that, you know what, have big hearts. This hey, can I joke. ask, Ed? Can I ask a question really quick, Ed? Do Please. you feel as though, like, throughout your life, you've had a problem with relaying information correctly? Of course I have. I'm not saying it's right. I'm not saying I'm perfect, but I wasn't you, thinking. I, I, and now the I, council I'm member speaks right up. Now. I got a question, Ed. Are you going to sit here and tell me that you genuinely love Rose? Yes, I did love her. Why is Rose saying that you used her? That's what I want to know. That, that's your prerogative and you have a right. You have a right. Hold on. You have a right. Yeah, Ed did definitely not think this whole thing would blow up in his face. It seems like, oh, I'm meeting this girl. I might, oh, and I get to get famous in the process. I don't think it was like going in into one of these things completely. He was thinking he could get all of it. Oh, I can get famous. Oh, I can get this. Oh, wait, people realize. I have a really ugly personality. Uh, uh, uh. I, I like to believe that people can change. Because uh, otherwise, what's the point? We're just going to tear each other down constantly over and over and over again. Even though maybe my hopes are not so high for Ed. But who knows what will happen in the future. Another episode. But I believe for once and for all, this is the conclusion of the Big Ed and Rose saga. Thank you for watching the follow-up. Hit like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more epic videos. Become member. Thank you guys so much. It's been great. Uh, I love that we made a sub community on this uh, channel now. Really fun stuff. Thanks for joining, and I'll see you guys next time. Hey, dope.